Excellency Vladimir Putin, President of the Russian Federation, Excellencies, Heads of State and Government, ladies and gentlemen, <clears throat> let me begin by thanking President Putin for the invitation and the warm welcome extended to me and my delegation. It is an honor to join you at the opening of the World Atomic Week a gathering of minds committed to the promise of science for a cleaner, more equitable future. Ethiopia stands at a pivotal moment. Our youths are vibrant, our cities are modernizing, our industries are growing, and our economy is among the fastest rising in the world. But our ambitions are higher ambitions that demand reliable, clean, and scalable energy. Hydropower, solar, and wind have carried us far. Yet alone, they cannot power the future we are building. For more than a decade, Ethiopia has been a champion of green energy. The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam, the largest in Africa, stands as a symbol of our determination. Our vision goes beyond today. To transform our nation, we look ahead and embrace with what is possible. Nuclear technology is that possibility. It provides reliable, low emission power, strengthens food security, equips doctors, optimizes water management, and empowers our scientists to innovate. For Ethiopia, nuclear is not only about energy, it's about people. It will unlock knowledge for our students, provide tools for farmers, and bring healing to patients. It is about expanding a foundation where opportunities multiply. We will pursue this responsibly. With careful planning, the highest safety standards, and by building a strong local capacity. For us, nuclear power is a strategic step in becoming an active participant in artificial intelligence, in industry, and innovation. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, in this context, I wish to recognize the Russian Federation which this year celebrates 80 years of its nuclear industry. Russia has shown the world what science can achieve when matched with vision. Ethiopia is ready to deepen partnership with Russia, combining their expertise with our skilled workforce and growing market to create a model of cooperation that powers our nation and inspires our continent. With more than 130 million people, we cannot afford to wait. Nuclear energy is essential to secure long-term development, diversify our energy mix, and realize Ethiopia's potential. Our goal is clear, a nuclear program that is safe, transparent, and exemplary. That's why we have chosen to pursue the peaceful use of nuclear energy with seriousness and alignment with international standards. We're also enjoying a huge amount of support from IAEA. Mr. Grossi is our partner on building this project. Ethiopia has already taken concrete steps. A roadmap with the Russian Federation lays out plans to build nuclear infrastructure train 
personnel, and the strengthen regulatory frameworks. A nuclear science and technology center is about to be established, and cooperation in peaceful applications of nuclear science is expanding. We are building the institutions, training talent, and designing a future where nuclear energy strengthens our sovereignty, supports our growth, and serves the next generation. We are committed to partnerships based on trust, knowledge, and mutual respect. And we welcome cooperation in technology transfer and safety training and reflect the realities of our economies. Together, we can turn ambition into achievement and challenges into possibilities. I thank you.